Hi guys, today I'm coming with a video that has been highly requested by so many of you guys because you know I had difficulty with breastfeeding and things like that. So I came up with some of my essentials as far as breastfeeding. So let's get started. First things first, if your baby is able to actually latch and is an effective sucker, then you're golden. But as for me, my son was everything but that. So I was a pumper. My son did not latch to the breast at all. He was fed through bottle. I have one of my pumps here, which happens to be a Medela. Both pumps that I had were Medellas. This is a manual pump. I also had one of the double electric pumps. I actually rented. My insurance company does not cover breast pumps. Next thing up, especially for those that have trouble with, you know, baby latching and things like that, you want to get nipple shields. This is one of the little cases that I got. This was not for the Medela nipple shields that they give you in the hospital. Because like in the hospital, if you need a nipple shield, it, the insurance pays for it. It's added to the bill, at least for my insurance it would. Anywho, I got this on the outside. I think I got this from Target when I had went and got one of the Tommy Tippy nipple shields. This is a Medela. This is Tommy Tippy. Next up, I know y'all probably gonna laugh at me for this, but you wanna make sure you get some uh, baggies for your breast milk. This is one of the lantinal, I think that's how you pronounce it, lantinal bags, but you don't have to get the lantinal bags. You don't have to get the Mandela bags because them sh are expensive. Here you go, right here. Mm-hmm, a dollar. Yeah, sandwich bags that are resealable. Put your breast milk in there, flatten it out, zip it down, lay it in the freezer flat like this, and bow. You want to make sure you got these. You want to make sure you have these. Are you hearing me? You want to make sure you are having these on you at all times. Why? You could be in the grocery store and you hear somebody else's baby cry and your body instantly goes into mommy mode and your letdown hits. What you gonna do? You gonna walk up out of there with a wet shirt. People gonna look at you like, what's wrong with this chick? Yeah, milk all on the shirt. Just have them on you. In your purse, in your diaper bag. I keep them on me at all times because you never know. No, I'm not breastfeeding no more, but I still lactate. Don't ask me why I don't know. These here are the bomb.com. My husband actually bought these. It's in a pouch, but this is what they look like. It's just little itty bitty beaties, little thingies. So this, this is what they look like. It's just basically like little itty bitty beads, like little gel basically is what it is. That's in one of these little pouch thingy warm it up when it's warm take this and then you want to stick it on your boob and this is to help with your letdown i i had a horrible horrible letdown like my letdown was horrible my supply was horrible everything about my breastfeeding experience horrible. last but not least wata you want to make sure you always have water on hand, especially when you're breastfeeding, because water is your best friend. You want to make sure you stay hydrated. If you're not hydrated, breast milk ain't going to come. Well, guys, that's it for today. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful to some of you guys that are actually out there trying to breastfeed or are having difficulties breastfeeding. Thumbs up this video if you haven't. Make sure you leave all your questions and comments below if you have them. As far as breastfeeding, I'm going to try to get a couple more videos out. That way, you know, I can help somebody that actually needs the help. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.